Hey guys, my name is Emil and you're watching Techno Right. What's going on guys? Welcome to TechnoRabbit Technology. It's done right. So in today's video, I'm going to teach you on how to add a dog-like object. So um, we're going to replicate what is on uh, the, the Max. So you can see at the bottom, they'll have like a dock where all their icons, the software, the programs are all there. So we're going to do that here today in Windows, okay? It's very simple. You're just going to need one software and the software is called Rocket Dog, okay? So you're going to go to your Chrome or your... Uh, any browser you want not judging by the way so you can just search rocket dog okay as you can see here rocket dog and the first link will come is punk labs click on that and then you go to you have all this okay you're going to scroll down until you see rocket dog okay you can see here it says rocket dog click on download okay let it download and uh, there are also skins where you can install for Rocket Dog. And if you want skins, you can just click on Rocket Dog and you can see there it says skins. And you can see this website. They have icons. You can customize icons and you can uh, add nice skins. As you can see, the dog skin and the icons can be like iMessage and all that. Okay, it looks really cool. So we're not going to go into that right now. We're just going to see how to install the basic doc okay so i'm going to open the installer click on yes for the administrator access click on ok next i accept the agreement next yep i'm going to install it there and don't create a desktop icon let's just leave this unchecked click on next install it's just basic installing and then click on finish and it should not come up you should not have anything okay what you're going to do is you're going to go to your start button and you're going to see here recently added it says rocket dog click on that and it should open at the top okay so we don't want this at the top we want it at the bottom so what you're going to do is you're going to go to, to dock settings okay and then you're going to go into position right here and then you can see here screen position make sure it's at the bottom at the bottom okay and then you can see here it says layering so basically what layering is when you open an app um, always on top suggest that the rocket dog may be on top the app so when you open Google Chrome you have this dog right here messing with your links where you want to click so you are going to leave that always on the bottom okay and then if you don't like it like very low you can just set it use this edge offset to bring it up a bit okay so i'm just going to leave it right there and then you can also bring it to the middle bring it to the side and all that by centering it okay just going to leave it right there okay now you can go down and you can see here it says style okay so you can basically add a lot you can see they they have inbuilt skins okay and then uh not only that the website i showed you just now you can install dead skins as well. So you have a lot, plenty of skins, okay? So I'm just going to leave it at crystalxp.net. And then you can add the, edit the text word where when you scroll over, you can see it says music, documents. You can edit that text to look uh, however you want, okay? So I'm just going to leave that. You can edit it. It's your wish. So in icons, what you're going to do is make sure it's low quality if you have a, uh, a very slow sluggish system if you have a medium end like gaming PC you can add average quality if you have like a top notch Ryzen 9 and uh, RTX 2080 Ti something like that you can go for high quality okay but I would recommend you average quality since it already gives the uh, ample amount of performance okay so yeah you can add it, this the zoom where it looks like Play two, so you can see it looks like that. When I click on bubble, it goes like a bubble type, okay. And then when you click on flat, it like just flat. So you can see it's like weird. I'm just gonna go bubble. It looks nice. And then in general, make sure you check run at startup, okay. 
you can do this minimize windows to dock where uh, when you minimize an application it usually goes to the taskbar but when you min when you minimize this okay i'm gonna click okay you can see okay well that didn't work okay i think you have to restart your pc to do that okay so uh, what it will do is when you uh, minimize this the app should appear here okay so yeah you have to restart your pc to do that to for all the changes to take effect okay and yeah basically you can i'm going to leave that unticked because i really don't like seeing where is my son but uh in mac os they will have the minimized applications in the dock so you can do it however you want so behavior i'm not going to do auto hide uh, auto hide is basically like you can see it just goes down okay so when you want it you have to like go down hover your mouse down and sh it should appear so i'm not going to do that it looks weird click on dock settings if i can oh god Okay, well, nope, not going to do that. Okay, basically that's about it, guys. So, um, yep. Disable this. Okay, so I'm going to teach you now how to add the uh, icon. So I'm going to add Google Chrome here, Steam, IMG Burn. Um, okay, you can see it takes a while sometimes because it's finding the icon, OBS Studio. Okay, so you can see here that uh, with my normal apps and the uh, downloaded apps, you can see that it doesn't have space, so it doesn't look like organized. So what you're going to do is you're going to go in the middle, right click, and then you're going to click on go to add item and you can see it says separator. Click on that, you'll have a cool little separator so you can like be organized with it. Okay, if you don't want an app, just hold it with your mouse and drag it out and that's it, it'll go. Okay, so basically that's about it guys. That's how to um, to install a Mac OS like dock in your Windows PC system. Okay, so in the upcoming video, I'll teach you on how to add skins and customize the icons of the Rocket Dock. So basically that's about it. If you have any other questions or any other problems, please put them down in the comments below. And I think, yeah, please rate, comment, and subscribe. And I'm out.